What was once the office and studio for Usher and his mom are now shared by Johnetta and her younger son, James. He is six years younger than Usher. How did you keep from having that feeling of jealousy between the brothers? Well, I never made, I never showed any different. You know, I love my kids all the same. And, you know, would do for James. James was just enjoying life, you know. And, and to be honest with you, I didn't know about his talent until we were actually looking for a band. And um, the music director, he was like, that's your drama right there. And it was James. And I was like, what? And Usher and I was so surprised. When we were on the road working, he was at home learning all of Usher's music, playing. And so it had, it developed into him as a producer. He's a really great producer. He uh, produced the song for um, Lord. It's called Get, Get It, let's see, Get It Shorty. Yeah, get it short. Get it short. <laughs> oh, say, see, he, he knows the song too. Yeah, that was a hit record. So he has a studio here in the building. Um, so he, he's a great producer. He's a, a really wonderful kid as well. Well, he's a man now. While JLAC is making music in one part of the building. Good morning, ladies. How are y'all doing today? Good, how are you? Johnetta is making entrepreneurs in her kitchen incubator and shared kitchens. Over six years, she's helped 300 chefs. You know, chefs are very skillful, they're very passionate, but they're not business savvy. And no different than a doctor, a lawyer, and that's why they have a team of people, you know, to handle their business. And that's how I created the incubator. I, it is a shared kitchen with business services because of my acumen, my business acumen. I understand business, they have the passion. So what we do here, is once they actually come into, once they join the kitchen, we actually have um, classes here. And it's, it's now it's one-on-one. -on -one. What is it that you need? Do you need an attorney? Do you need a business manager? Do you need an accountant? Do you need a publicist? Well, let me introduce you to that person. John Netta enjoys her work, but enjoys her five grandchildren even more. She's proud of both of her sons, and the work Usher's New Look Foundation has done in the community for 22 years to keep young people in school who come from underserved communities. And at the end of the day, um, however it turned out, I knew he was gonna be fine whatever he did because he's, he's, he's phenomenal. He really is a good kid, I mean a, a man. He was a good kid then, but he's, he's learned a lot. You know, he's experienced a lot and it's nothing better than life experiences. You know, it makes you who you really are. And uh, to see him as a father, to see him as an artist, uh, to see him as an actor, to see him at, you know, doing the, the philanthropic work that he does. I'm just so amazed in, uh, of, of, of who he is and to be his mom. She is the example of what it is to be a selfless parent to her child. And as a result of that, it made me the man that I am. It made me obviously the artist that I am. I wouldn't be the artist that I am here today to deliver this message if that woman didn't believe it before everybody else did. Deliver it, receive it, hold it, protect it, and then deliver it for the world. So she is everything. She is the golden goose. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. I love you.